So, Ann, I think what you're hearing is that uh, the governor has talked uh, quite a bit about supplanting, and I think there's a real concern on our side, first, whether it, uh, it fits the intention of the, uh, of the stimulus bill, and, and secondly, whether uh, we can get away with it with the federal government, because it sounds to me like uh, uh, they have said pretty much that you cannot use uh, these funds to supplant, that you should be using it to create new jobs and, uh, and, and not to... Uh, uh, find a way to not spend your money um, that you're already planning on spending anyway. So that's sort of where we are. A difference of opinion, we'll see where that really goes. Well, uh, personally, I, and I think I, I think we probably all agree that uh, supplanting is, is is not particularly a good idea. We have an opportunity to really do some uh, some uh, some good things for districts, for example, in school districts, and I think we should take advantage of that. Well, we've got the money there to fund uh, education as we had planned, uh, so that's. That's a healthy budget, and we're fine with that, uh, I believe. And I actually should let the finance co-chair speak to it. But it, it seems to me that it's a good opportunity to do some additional things that we have not been able to do in the past, uh, to help train teachers in special ed and, uh, and in Title I, and uh, to get equipment that we've not been able to get for kids in, in special ed. So I think there's some real advantages to the stimulus bill that we have not, uh, that, that we will come to, we'll be in a much better position when this is over.